A U.S. judge has dismissed a lawsuit charging Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi with crimes against humanity during the 2002 Gujarat riots. The New York-based judge upheld the U.S. government's contention that Mr. Modi was entitled to immunity as a sitting head of government. A rights group filed the civil suit against Mr. Modi in September on the eve of his maiden visit to the U.S. More than 1,000 people, mostly Muslims, were killed in the religious riots. The riots were sparked by a fire on a train at Ghadra in Gujarat that killed 59 Hindu pilgrims. Mr. Modi, who was the chief minister of Gujarat at the time of the riots, came under intense criticism for his handling of the riots. Human rights groups say he failed to take measures to prevent retribution against Muslims. Mr. Modi has denied any wrongdoing and Indian courts have cleared him of all charges. In September, the American Justice Center filed a lawsuit against Mr. Modi, which claimed that he did nothing to stop the riots. The 28-page complaint also charged the Prime Minister with committing crimes against humanity, extrajudicial killings, torture and inflicting mental and physical trauma on the victims, mostly from the Muslim community. Judge Annalisa Torres's dismissal of the lawsuit comes ahead of a planned visit to Delhi by U.S. President Barack Obama to attend India's Republic Day celebrations on January 26 at Mr. Modi's invitation. The U.S. and European countries boycotted Mr. Modi for more than a decade after the riots, but have largely embraced him after he led his Bharatiya Janata Party BJP, to a landslide election win last year. Mr. Modi visited the U.S. in September and held talks with Mr. Obama, where the two leaders called for a new agenda between the two countries.